and welcome to this very special interaction with the man who is perhaps the father of the Indian IT industry, Narayan Murthy. Thank you so much for joining us uh, in this interview, sir. Let me start with the fact that 30 years of Infosys and such a long journey for yourself, it's some kind of a crossroad right now. What does the next decade hold for, let's say, you and uh, Infosys as a company? Well, you know, I'll be reaching 65 next year and that's the time when I will retire. I'll retire on 20th August 2011. Afterwards I will continue with uh, Catamaron which is the VC operations that I have started. Maybe who knows my son or daughter or somebody else may also get interested so that I can gradually withdraw from that. And at the same time, I'm on the board of HSBC and a few universities, as well as I'm on the board of trustees of Rhodes Scholarship. I suppose I will continue with them till I complete the tenure, and then I will lead a peaceful life, hopefully playing with my grandchildren. So why peaceful? Why not politics? Uh, you know, I mean, I have had several opportunities in the past to be part of uh, the government in some way, but I desisted from that because I uh, I'm not I don't think I'll be comfortable with uh, th with that canvas. You know I'm used to working with a certain kind of people. I'm used to looking at every issue based on data and facts. I'm used to open discussion and debate. I'm used to meritocracy. You know I'm used to a certain level of excellence. Uh, in some way, I've been spoiled by this environment for the last 30 years. So I don't know if I will succeed in, in that complex environment. And that's being very modest because you know that uh, there is a certain amount of following for a person like you, that there is a amount of recognition, especially in the urban centers. You are, you've been a job creator. So why not sort of expand that and, you know, take a leadership role if that comes your way? Well, let me put it this way, if, if there is some way where I can contribute very effectively without uh, uh, causing too much of uh, uh, concern for others while having a sense of achievement, certainly I think one could look at that. Why because not? at some point in time we were all quite enthusiastic about reports of Narayan Murthy being the president of India. Well, I think you, you people have been very, very kind and, you know, in any case, that's not going to be available till 2012, so it's too early. Too early to comment too on Too early, yeah. Well, let me ask you, let's go back in time, 30 years, you started Infosys with a dream, a vision, you've arrived here and, you know, quite a mammoth achievement that is. But if you were to start it all over again, yeah. what would you do different? No, let me first of all say that I will... Uh, run this marathon with the same set of people because they are extraordinary people. Every one of them, uh, Raghavan, Nandan, Chris, Dinesh, Shibulala, Shokarora. I think these people are truly extraordinary. They have a wonderful value system. They, we all work together as a fantastic team. Uh, so I would work with the same people. There would be no, no difference at all. But, but I think as we move forward, there'll be many other areas of uh, uh, opportunity for teams like ours. So I suppose uh, we would uh, probably choose, you know, maybe another area where we can make a fundamental difference to the people. And at the same time, we can uh, realize reasonable profits. We can at the same time create wealth for us and wealth for a large number of people. 